Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today, we're gonna do something a little bit different for me. So these are all inspiration from my Christmas list. I'm obviously not asking for all of this. Just wanna give like a quick disclaimer, like that'd be absolutely crazy. Um, I'm gonna start out with clothing. Okay, free people movement. Some of my favorite things from them would be the Happiness Runs tanks, priced at 30 bucks, which is very expensive. So if you can get these secondhand, that's great. If you wanna buy them for 30, I think they're worth it. The Way Home shorts, also 30 bucks, expensive, but I think so worth it. And they last for a really long time. I've had mine for two years and they're still going strong. They're the Love Letter tank. This one's very pricey, it's $38. I don't know if I can really justify it, but it's fine. I'm obsessed with this tank top. I only have it in white right now, but I really want to find some other colors. They also have an Amazon dupe that looks pretty much the exact same, and it's like 20 bucks, I think. The Righteous Runzy retails for 98. Absolutely insane, in my opinion, but so cute. So many colors. We have the Hotshot Onesie, 70. Then the Hotshot mini dress. This one's like blown up recently. And then from Billabong, there's the Wild Pursuit romper. This is super versatile. You can dress it up or down. They have like some of my favorite graphic tees there. Why am I like rushing through this? I need to chill. Some crew necks you could get from Etsy. I've seen some cute ones. Also Billabong. Oh, the Beach Club has really good crew necks and t-shirts. I've never gotten any of them, so I don't really know what I'm talking about, but super cute. Oh, you could ask for some workout sets. Um, Set Active has them. Lululemon, of course. Amazon has cheap ones. I don't know if they're the best quality. I've heard a lot about Olive Lynn tanks. They come in a bunch of like cute colors. They seem to be like pretty affordable. I think they're in like the 20 dollars my jean recommendations are Grey Bandit and American Eagle and Target. I've like struggled trying to find jeans that actually fit me, but those brands are most likely to fit. Socks. Marshalls has some really good socks. Free People. Oh, Natural Life has fun socks too. Of course you could ask for Lululemon leggings if you want to do that. Ooh, airy. Uh, you could ask for wide leg sweatpants from them. They also have great sweaters. Oh, and then also Elevated Faith has some really fun sweatshirts and t-shirts that are like Christian based. And moving on to shoes. I'm obsessed with the Ugg Tasman slippers. Then there's the Coquette Ugg slippers. Another Ugg that's a fun option is the Ugg Classic Ultra Mini Boots. Converse, you can go so many different ways with Converse. Some of the embroidered ones you can get on Etsy. And then there's some on just regular Converse. Dunks, I am not a sneakerhead at all. So I don't really know like the names or the colors, but I know what Dunks are. New Balance 550s, I love these shoes. I also like the other New Balance like retro type shoes. Hoka's, you can do so many different color patterns. I've heard they're great for running. The only thing is my mom got a pair and they were like really like chunky looking on her So I don't know if that's gonna be your look. I really want some hokas. I don't mind how thick they are I think it gives a nice little bounce What was this? Why am I literally through my list? And it's only been like seven minutes. Oh, yeah, we're good. We have a lot of stuff left Don't you worry. Okay, let's move on to skincare and makeup Drunk Elephant is a skincare and makeup brand. I've heard a lot of good things about them. You can also check out the dupes. I've heard that e.l.f. has like a ton of dupes for them. Glossier, bomb.com, cloud paint. I love this stuff. I got it like two years ago for Christmas and I still have more than half left. Okay, Rare Beauty. Apparently the blushes, the highlighters, and I think the bronzers are all really popular. And lastly for makeup, Charlotte Tilbury. But again, it's super expensive. <laughs> so I like to pick one or two things that are more pricey and make them like the main gift on my wish list. Okay, moving on to jewelry. Could go with just a cute Kendra Scott necklace. I don't have a Kendra Scott necklace, but I've heard a lot about them. They come in a bunch of cute colors, expensive again, but I think they're worth the investment. Then my favorite, Jack Maria jewelry. I'm actually wearing them right now. It's a cute little seashell. Oh, my mom works for a jewelry company. It's called Nande. They have some really fun stuff there. And what else? Let's go to books. Okay, so first I have The Ballad of Songbirds and Snakes. The movie just came out for this one. I absolutely loved it. It just felt so similar to the book and I loved the book. So you should definitely go check it out. Shatter Me series, The Inheritance Games. I'm literally only on book one, but it seemed like, like a just all around crowd pleaser. And then you could get like a fun little journal Bible. Mine is from She Reads Truth. You can just Bible journal in the blank spots. 
Let's do bathing suits. My top favorite bathing suit companies are Billabong. I've never had a triangle bathing suit, but they're super cute. So triangle, Kulani Kinis, Target has good ones, super affordable. Um, oh, and O'Neal has really cute ones. And okay, now we're moving to like miscellaneous. First, I'm gonna say blankets. Some of my favorite blankets are from Natural Life. They're so pretty. I think it might just be because it's like super my style, but I love Natural Life blankets. There's also some on Etsy for like the crochet chunky ones. Those are super cute. You can find them on Etsy. Pretty affordable prices, I think, because they're like handmade. Oh, you could get like a fun beach towel. I know that Urban Outfitters has some good ones. Erin Made is a really fun, pretty brand with backpacks and they have totes and also like zip up hoodies. Fun pillows, you could get them from Amazon, Target. A Stanley, basic, but I love well, I loved my Stanley. Someone stole it and I, I didn't lose it, I swear. Someone actually stole it. Candles, art supplies, puzzles. I love puzzles. Honestly, I think that's it. This is a really weird video for me to make. But I'll be back with my what I got for Christmas video. Better than ever and ready to talk to and ready to talk straight to the camera. So, see you guys next time. Stop the video.